Hey there, welcome to the Overcomers of Relapse Podcast. I am D, your host. This is episode 10, the final episode of season 6 of my podcast. So welcome to all listeners out there. It is great to share this experience with you. The introduction of each podcast episode of season 6 will start off with a great meditation track. I got such great feedback about this track from our previous season, and I tell you, I enjoy it very much myself. It helped relieve the tension and stress we all deal with in our everyday busy lives. So, sit back and enjoy. I will be right back with today's topic and discussion. So, come on, relax and place all life problems and concerns on pause. Let's take a flight on Angel Wings. Enjoy. Man, I hope 
It brought you a feeling of serenity and to a place of clarity. Like I say every time, it works for me. So I certainly hope it works for you because every time I listen to it, I just get that feeling that I know everything, everything will work out all right. Before we get started with today's topic, I would like to announce that I have a service that I am offering to the public that is called Ask D. This is a service that is on YouTube that will allow all listeners to ask questions on any topics we have discussed on the podcast or any questions in general you may have. Also, I would like listeners to leave comments or questions in comment section of Ask D YouTube segments. My credentials to answering questions are based on me being a certified life coach and I am more, more than happy to share answers from my views, experiences, and expertise and also offer the listening audience an opportunity to give advice from each other to each other that may give other solutions to any matters concerning their well-being. Hey, come on, people. With everyone involved, maybe, just maybe, we can make some sense of this crazy thing called life. So come on, people. Please come along. Come join us. Thank you very much. Now, let's get started with today's episode. I just want to put this out there right from the beginning. This podcast is not only pertaining to relapse as far as drugs, alcohol, or any other addictions. We are open to all topics. However, our main topic is why do we have addictive behaviors and how can we overcome them? On episode 10, the final episode of season 6, I would like to use for a topic, GMC. Cause you bossed up. <laughs> That's right. G M C. Cause you bossed up. Now, this episode, this particular episode is especially dedicated to all of my addicts and recovery addicts. Let's first start by looking at the definition of the words bossed up. The words bossed up is defined as a slang term to begin to act or approach something with resolve, determination, and all of one's efforts. Getting bossed up is about Owning your own power in the face of injustice. Daring, daring the rise up despite the obstacles unfairly presented before you by committing to treat yourself with respect. Knowing your worth and owning your power over your own life. For example. If I really want to make it happen, I knew I was going to have to boss up. My addicts and recovery addicts, if anyone, and I mean if anyone, can boss up is an addict or a recovering addict that is fighting for their life. And I am talking about us. Addicts and recovering addicts. We, as people that have been battling addiction all of our lives, and you are still maintaining some kind of sanity, hey, you are a boss. Now, hey, I know there are a lot of us that are probably thinking, 
Hey, dude, right now, I do not feel like a boss at all. I am still struggling with staying clean, relapsing from time to time, and I mean problem after problem, and with just everything that has been going on this year, 2020, I am surprised I am still alive. I mean, I already have to give it all I got every single moment to fight this monster addiction. It rides me, man, day and night, and it never lets up. With everything that is going on in the world these days, I don't know how much longer I can hold on. I mean, I cry out, I cry out to my higher power and thought to myself, well, I guess things could be worse. Well, guess what? <laughs> they got worse. <laughs> Sounds familiar? Yeah, it sounds like quite a few of us addicts and recovery addicts story. Hey, trust me, my friends. I know exactly, exactly how you feel. But the point is, no matter how hard it has been, and even if you have failed or relapsed, you are still a boss. Cause if you are anything, anything like me, you have been through experiences that would have killed most people, but yet you managed to stay alive. My friend, that takes a lot of strength, courage, and endurance. That takes someone who can boss up. No matter how addictions tries to take them out, and trust me, <laughs> I know all about the knockout punch of addictions. And I also know a lot of people who did not get back up, did not try to get back up. <laughs> I know a lot of people, they just said, you know what? The hell with it. This is who I am meant to be. And I accept my faith. And I am going to use until there is no more of me to be used. Hey. My friends, you are a survivor. You have fighting, been fighting this cunning and baffling disease over and over again. You know why? Because you refuse to give up. You know, someone once told me, it's not how many times a man gets knocked down that makes him a champion. It's how many times he can get back up. You tell me this. Who can testify with me that fighting this disease, an addict, a recovering addict, most likely has experienced more knocks downs than a Rocky movie. <laughs> and I am talking about all sequels put together. <laughs> you know? Yeah, that's right. You bossed up. Even when it looks like addiction have completely completed its victory over you. When the count started, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Something in you said stop. Right before the knockout number 10, you managed to grab the ropes. The ropes is your higher power, the strength of your higher power. Stand yourself up and continue to fight. 
you bossed up. And that, my friend, takes a person with a mindset that refuses to give up under any circumstances. <laughs> oh yeah, buddy. We boss up. Now, here, here is the great news. We already know we have the ability to boss up. My fellow addicts, recovery addicts, it is GMC time. And I don't mean the car. <laughs> I, I make this declaration and I am pushing my faith toward all addicts and recovering addicts. GMC. We all are G going to M make a C comeback. <laughs> That's right, baby. GMC. You have already survived. And now it is time to show off all those muscles you have developed fighting this disease. Spiritually, mentally, and even physically to the world. Hey. Addicts, recovery addicts, listen, you will regain everything this disease has taken from you. Hey, you have already shown it that it was not strong enough to knock you out of the game. And now it is time to GMC and win the game. My friends, hey, I leave you with this. Anyone, anyone who can boss up can rise up. Anyone who can fail can GMC. Because what the, uh, what the addict disease, the addiction disease, the addiction disease, I hate it, used as its weapon to try and kill us, our DOA, drug of choice, guess what? It backfired. You know, there's a saying, what doesn't kill us makes us stronger. It makes us unstoppable. So, hey, if no one else pets you on the back and tell you this, I am telling you this. You are a champion because you bossed up. And I am sure, I am pretty sure you are going to GMC. Let's do it. <laughs> well, that's it for episode 10, the final episode of season 6. Please visit my website. The Overcomers of Relapse Lounge is listed on the screen. Please feel free to post on blog, share thoughts, and also feel free to chat. Contact information is on there also, along with a lot of great music. Also, my friends, come join us on my Facebook group called Overcomers Relapse Lounge. We have a lot of great inspiring posts and just a great, a great group of people to chat with. Also, also, please be sure to check out Ask D on YouTube. All information can be found with the introduction video on YouTube. Hey, let me know your opinions and thoughts. And also, if you would like to be a guest on the podcast. Hey, and I look forward to season seven podcasts. Thanks again for joining me. Talk with you all again very soon. Take care of yourselves out there. Bye bye. Uh,
the courage, the things that I can. I know there's a little of a difference in the world. Go, go, no, no, no. Said I'll never do it again. No, 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 no. Man, I said. No, 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 no. No, no, said I'll never do it again. No, 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 no. Well, I'm No, 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 no. Said I'll never do it again. No, 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 no. Man, I said. No, 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 no. no, 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 no.